Hello, I'm Jennifer Castoldi from Trendies International and we are at Tech Textile and Tech Process where the Innovation Awards just took place and the best sustainable solution went to Picasso and I'm here with Carla Silva, who is the chief scientist behind the innovation. Thank you for joining us today. Good, Jennifer. So tell me, what is Picasso? So Picasso actually is a, a new dyeing technology. So we use only um, natural ingredients for the dyeing. As you know, dyeing is one of the most pollutant processes in the textile industry. So in this project, we replace it all the chemicals involved in the dyeing process, namely the dyes by natural plants and natural ingredients that also contains molecules that can provide color to, to textiles. So it's a sustainable process. We are, use, we are dyeing cotton and uh, cotton blends like lyocell and wool at very low temperatures, 40 degrees, 60 degrees, and using only natural ingredients that are completely safe and, and, and safe to the environment, but also safe to the end user. So they're ingredients like plants and mushrooms. Exactly. Some of the ingredients, as you can see here, these are uh, tea extracts, actually. So we are using plants, uh, the residues from teas. The, the, you mostly use the leaves, but then the, the, the rest of the plant you can use for dyeing. And also mushrooms uh, that contains a high amount of phenolic compounds, which is a natural uh, molecule that we are using and exploring in Picasso. And can this dye be used on many different types of, of textiles and different product categories? Exactly. Uh, we are most focusing on Picasso for now on fashion uh, because it's the most uh, obvious application. And dyeing cotton, which is, is quite demanding, wool is wonderful for dyeing with this technology, but also cotton blends with lyocell and other uh, synthetic and artificial fibers. And uh, it can be used actually for, for other applications, for instance, for bedding and for, for uh, home uh, uh, textiles, it could also be used because actually in Picasso, the, the plants has, have also uh, active ingredients, as you know, so they can also provide antimicrobial activity for the textiles. So not only we are providing color, but we can provide them functionality, so like uh, antimicrobial based on actual ingredients, so they can be used for uh, bedding, for instance. Fantastic. I know you've been working many years on this innovation. Yes. Yes. How does it stand up to industry standards like color fastness and such? Exactly. So, um, that actually, this technology started many years ago at Senti and uh, now being, is being explored by Tintex, a textile Portuguese company. And at this moment, we are doing this scale up because uh, it has to have light fastness, which was one of the most difficult to achieve. When you do coloration with natural plants, uh, as we used to do in 2000 years ago, but the light fastness uh, was not good. So we managed to achieve light fastness using only natural ingredients and also wash fastness. So for the moment, we are just uh, exploring new colors, but because the process is completely ready to go to the market in terms of fastness. And Fantastic. Quality. So it's already commercially viable. It is already commercially viable. I'm looking forward to see in the market so I can also be a client of these uh, nice colors and nice fashion Wonderful. designs. Well, congratulations yeah. on your award for Best Sustainable Solution. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, Jennifer. Thank you.